in the region, Venezuelan opposition leader Juan Guaido has announced the final phase of his attempt to bring about the end of President Maduro's rule and says he has military support. In a video apparently recorded at an Air Force base and published on social media, he is seen with men in uniform. He calls for the military to help him end the usurpation of power by Mr. Maduro. The military has so far supported Mr. Maduro and refused to back Mr. Guaido, who declared himself interim president in January and has backing from dozens of countries, including most of Latin America and the United States. And in international news, the Indian Army has claimed to have found footprints of Yeti, sparking jokes and disbelief on social media. The Army tweeted to its nearly 6 million followers on Monday that it had discovered mysterious footprints of mythical beast Yeti at the Makalu base camp in the Himalayas. There is no evidence proving Yeti's existence, but the myth remains a strong appeal in South Asian folklore. The Yeti, also known as the Abominable Snowman, is a legendary creature that is said to inhabit the upper reaches of the Himalayas. Stories of people seeing the Yeti or its footprints are common in parts of India, Nepal, and Bhutan. And finally, US President Donald Trump has sued two banks in a bid to stop them from handing over his financial records to Congress. The lawsuit against Duche Bank and Capital One were filed after Democrat-led committees issued subpoenas for information on his finances. His three eldest children and the Trump Organization joined the lawsuit, which argues there are no legitimate grounds for investigating his business affairs. Leading Democrats said they would not be detoured by the blocking attempt. In 2017, the bank rejected requests by the Democrats in the House of Representatives to provide details of the president's finances, citing privacy laws. Headline News, Bibi Bacchus.